So in this demo, I'm going to give you a quick overview of how uh, you can use SciCapture to auto-process and extract uh, scanned or any type of documents, process them, and then add them to Office 365 SharePoint Online with managed metadata, content types, you can build folders. Really, you can control just about any granular aspect of, of how documents are, are added to, uh, to Microsoft's cloud-based SharePoint. So let's take a quick look. I'm going to actually auto process some inbound mail correspondence. And one of the challenges with this piece of correspondence is that the file number or case number can be anywhere on the page. So we're going to use advanced data extraction in SciCapture to go ahead and find that, auto extract it, and then add it to SharePoint as uh, managed metadata. So let's go ahead and, uh, and paste into an auto processing folder. So with SciCapture, you can have uh, network folders, SharePoint libraries, uh, or you can uh, monitor write facts for inbound, uh, inbound images. So it's going to go ahead and queue it up, start to process it, and then extract data. So we'll give it a second here, and um, we'll go ahead and navigate into uh, my Office 365 site. And I've got a library here. Note that SciCapture can auto-create libraries, it can uh, build taxonomies on the fly. It's also got the, build, the ability to automatically build column structures as well in Office 365. So in this example, right now it's processing and you can see I've got uh, five documents in that batch and it's going to slowly but surely as I refresh the page build out a nice standardized folder structure in SharePoint based on the extracted case number. So if we look at the original document, you can see that it goes ahead and, and plucks the, the file or case number and then automatically builds a folder structure. Now in that folder, I get a nice searchable PDF with a customized file name. So I've got my file or case number dash document type. And I've also populated my metadata fields. Now the file number here is a Manage Metadata column. So if I come in and I edit my properties, not only did I build out the metadata fields, but I also automatically built my file number um, uh, taxonomy or term set. So now on the fly, real time, I'm building a taxonomy that can be used later for additional file numbers. So you could, as new cases come in, scan these documents, and once again, auto-build that structure. Okay, This is just a real small glimpse of the features that you have with SciCapture. Now we can use images. In later demos, I'm going to actually show you how you can process emails, Word files, and you can even use spreadsheets to automatically build structures as well. If you have any questions, shoot a note to sales at SciGen.com. Thanks.